joined Rotary um, uh, because uh, uh, really since my children had gone to school, I had become very involved in different um, volunteer organizations, mainly women's organizations, but um, uh, certainly different community activities. And then when my husband died, my, the course of my life and pattern of my life changed radically. Um, and uh, so a couple of years went by. And then a friend of mine who was a Rotarian and also a Probus uh, member um, said, why don't you come to a Rotary meeting? So I said, yes, and uh, I arrived. And I was very interested in the speakers and um, enjoyed it a lot. So after a bit, um, I was invited to become a member because I knew several of the men there at the time from different boards that I'd been sitting on. So um, that was when I became a member. And as I say, one of the very early women members, um, and there were just a handful of us, and then the experience of, of um, attending meetings, which was so different then to now. Probably just an extension of uh, what I have said, that I felt that I was belonging to a community. And the it was a community with a purpose, which I really feel good about. Um, and the attitude was very positive, that you can do attitude, like an Alberta um, attitude, which amazed Michael and me when we first came to Canada. But anyway, um, I just like to be participating in activities um, in connection with other people. And of course it was, uh, as we say, giving back to the community and helping. Um, and it continued to give a broader perspective on the needs of the local community in Calgary and in Canada and then overseas. And I also really enjoyed having links with other clubs and finding out what they were doing. Um, I very much enjoy the speakers. I don't have the energy now um, uh, necessarily to participate in as much as I would like to, not in a hands-on way, um, but there are other ways of participating. You can always write a check. <laughs> and um, so I like to continue my membership. Uh, the camaraderie, um, the, the, the fun that we can have um, at Rotary um, and the long-term friendships that develop. Um, and again, a sense of participation um, with others in, in useful projects. I mean, it takes me back to my ancient roots in England, when as just a young girl, everybody was expected to do their bit um, in World War II and after World War II. Um, you had to knit scarves for sail soldiers and sailors, or you had to participate in some way to improve the dire situation we were in. And I think that was an early start to my volunteer activities, both um, in Britain and then subsequently in, in Canada. And that attitude of being part of a group, which is uh, trying to make things better um, and uh, really follow what we say, uh, what our four-way test is, that what we do, is it true um, and is it fair? Um, and does it improve lives and does it does it build friendships so that's why I stay <laughs> <laughs>